Howdy everyone, your Pyral here with another episode of Omori. Last episode, we sacrificed a bunch of things, including a mole, and now we're here in bread heaven? Purgatory? I don't know. But there seems to be something here at the top of these stairs, so let's check it out. I have a feeling it's a boss fight, but luckily, luckily our HP is and juice is all maxed out. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold up. Uh, important. Where is... Uh, treasure map. Is there a thing here? No. Huh. Bread people. Biscuit. And doughy. Biscuit and doughy. Okay then. Wh which one is which? What's going on? We were born to make bread forever, day in and day out. Fresh bread. Fresh bread. Fresh bread. It's a hard life, and it's not very rewarding, but this is all we have. We just have to be grateful. Right, Biscuit? Oh-ho. That's right, brother. This has always been our life. Trapped in an endless circle of bread. Oh-ho. 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 So this is where the wailing was coming from. Ah, oh, the bread. It is spoken. I knew that our bread would come back to haunt us eventually. Come, Biscuit, we must destroy them before they destroy us first. Wait a sec, we're not... Oh-ho! 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 So we have a fight here against... The Unbred Twins. Interesting. I think in um the other world in the in the grocery store the owner of the bakery I think they mentioned having twin kids. So is this a reflection of that? Anyways, I'm gonna go with my usual uh mock and annoy strategy. Can I make bread angry? Is that how it works? Well, hopefully this works now. We dealt the damage, lowered their attack, they pull out bread from the oven. Huh. Interesting. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now... Um, let's attack the sourdough. Sure. Get it out of the way. And what I'm going to do is actually I'll have I'll have Aubrey make Kel happy for next turn and then heal up Kel Ooh, attack together that's a lot of damage. At least, at least the uh, Cal is going to be healed up of, of this damage that he took. Okay, so now, gonna attack the Sardo more. What is this music? It's crazy. Make Omori happy. Attack the Sardo again, and then cook for yourself. Ooh, we haven't. We almost have enough for a follow-up attack. Don't! Oh, you jerk. Okay, so then here's what I'm gonna do. Attack the unbred twins. And then you use the bread on hero, cause I will- OH! PISS! I accidentally did that. 
You know what? That's fine. That's fine. I'll deal with it. Yeah, eat eat the bread for yourself. Oh, or for Amori, sure. This isn't how I wanted this turn to go. But it's fine. It's fine. Snack. Let's see. What's one for everyone? Um. That's. Let's go with the popcorn. And you. will use the life jam on your brother. Just like that. Then release energy. This is gonna deal a ton of damage, especially since Amori is happy. So... This might even bring them down to at least half of their HP left. 1500. Fresh bread. Fresh bread. Every day it's fresh bread. Oh. They're sad. They can no longer be happy or angry. Okay, then. Don't like that. Don't like that at all. Okay, so... Um, happy is weak to sad, right? So... Angry should be it? If I'm remembering this right... Let's see, attack... Do I have a toy that'll make everyone angry? I do. Actually, no. I keep on... Like, I, I always jump to the conclusion that I'm selecting uh, Kel to use a thing when it's Aubrey just because she goes after Amori. I keep on getting ahead of myself there. Air horn, and then snack time. Of course. Of course it's that. Okay, good. We're dealing the damage now. Uh, I don't like that. Okay, hero, feed everyone. Have everyone just angrily eat. We're doomed to bake bread for all eternity. Aren't we, Biscuit? Oh, I'm sorry. Not my problem. Skill. Cook for Aubrey. I'm gonna save up for another follow up attack. Or big follow up attack, as I'm gonna call it. Oh! Slice. Interesting. You know what, I'm just going to continue to attack the Umbred Twins. I should have probably have had Hero use his heal everyone thing. Yeah, you're, heal yourself, it doesn't matter, Slice. Okay, Slice attacks Amori. Got a critical hit on them. We're running out of supplies. What do we do, Biscuit? Oh, they're depressed. Ooh. Interesting. Okay, so... we're. I think we're dealing more damage now, at least. Oh, and they're losing a lot of juice now. Umbred Twins forgot something in the oven. Yeah, they're losing a lot of juice from this. Good. The more juice they lose, I guess, the less they'll be able to use some of their skills. Although, I'm not really sure if the skills they use would require them to use up any of their juice. I don't know. Everyone feels angry. We're already angry, so it's not like it really matters. Okay, the unbred twins are almost done for. 
Cool. We're, we're doing good. Okay, just hit us some more. You know what? I think... Oh, we're running low on everything. We have almost nothing left. They're miserable. Huh. Yeah, I'm just gonna continue to attack. Oh, that did nothing! They're losing juice now. There's no... no HP. Hmm. Huh. How do I... Do I just continue to attack Slice then? I don't know. I mean, that's really all I can do at this point if they're just going to take zero damage. Okay, good. Oh, you're healing yourself now. I don't like that. How do I... It's not working. How do I deal more damage to them? Do I need to go beyond angry? Oh, they're attacking together. Good. Well, that's not good. Okay, well... Kel, you can use another life jam. Perfect. Use it on Aubrey. And that should be good enough for me to do this. Is this gonna deal any damage though? I'm kind of worried that it won't. Please? Please? Oh, thank you. That didn't... Oh, no. Oh, no. Well, they're dealing so much damage now. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hmm. Do I just... Oh, what do I do? Let's snack, life jam on you, attack, and then snack time. Okay, we're dealing damage now. So, that's good. But they're dealing a ton of damage. Hey, I don't know how this happened all of a sudden. Okay, I can do this. They're almost done. Yeah. They might be going down this turn. Did it work? Nope. Come on! Hero, finishing blow? Oh, thank you. Our resources have been depleted. What will we do with that ingredients? Oh. Ooh, scary. A lot of experience, though. Well worth it. Last resort? That's a Pokemon move. So it... Is Tickle a Pokemon move? Yes, it is. And Dazzle. That's not a Pokemon move. Oh, nice achievement there. We're all out of juice, it seems. That this is the end for us, Biscuit. Wait, we're not bread. We're kids, just like you. You, you mean you're not here to destroy us? Of course not. We would never attack unprovoked. You hear that, Biscuit? I mean, we attack other enemies like bunnies unprovoked. Now it's back to baking. Fresh bread. Fresh bread. Fresh bread. Oh. How do we get out of here? How long have you guys been baking bread here? Do you want to go outside and get some fresh air? If only that were possible. We've been trapped here since the inception of the universe. Wow, that sounds like a pretty long time. I think you both deserve a break. What? That's preposterous. What meaning do our lives have if we do not spend it baking bread? Oh, if we were to leave our bread-making stations, what would we do with ourselves? 
This is the only life we know. And yet, my morbid curiosity overwhelms me. That portal up there is able to transport us out of this place. We've used it countless times to fulfill our bread summonings, but we've never seen the other side for ourselves. Well, we have. And let me tell you, it's a big awesome world out there. I think it's about time that you guys start exploring new possibilities. Hmm. Tempting. Well, what do you think, Biscuit? Oh. Hmm. I'm listening. Hmm. Yes. But... Ah. Uh, that is true. Alright, we've changed our minds. We want to leave. This place sucks. <laughs> nice. Biscuit, we've always been afraid to use the portal, but perhaps it's time for change. Come on, brother. Let's experience our first taste of freedom. Go on. So, now that that's done, let's check out these skills. You got last resort. Deals damage based on Aubrey's heart, but Aubrey becomes... T so it's... According to Pokemon terms, it's not like the actual move last resort in Pokemon. It's more like the move... Is it Final Gambit, where you just trade in your HP to deal however much damage you uh, you have? Like, so if you trade in, like, in this case, 200 HP or heart, you would deal two dam 200 damage. Is that what it would be? Or is there, like, a ratio? Like, for every heart you do, you do, like, like two times the damage? If so, that'd be really powerful. I don't see myself using that just because I would be really running out of life jams if that were the case. Let's see. Tickle. All attacks on a foe will hit right in the heart for the turn. Oh. So, critical hit. For a turn. That might be useful. Let's see. And you had Dazzle. Reduces all foes attack and makes them happy. That could also be very useful. Interesting. Well, let's leave this place. Wait. I wanted to check the fridge. Oh, whatever. I'll be fine. Maybe. Oh, are these supposed to be like gravestones? Huh. Bread phones. Sure. What do these do? Let's see, two rolls of bread, heart plus 10, defense plus 10, life jam will heal more heart when used- Ooh! Ooh, that could be really- Huh. Would that- Uh, huh. Huh. Maybe this. Ooh. Huh. I don't know. I don't know. Can I, like, go back here? And I, I want to check, like, the things that I missed. Because you never know. And there might be something back here, too. Oh, it's the ghost of actual mole. I don't think I've forgotten what you did. Anyway, it's just because I'm a ghost now doesn't mean I can't dig my way out of here. I'm not... No, I'm not going back. Let's see the perfect spot. Oh, do I have to? So I can't go back into that room anymore? Huh. Well, I don't think I really missed anything. Okay, well, uh, yeah, take me out. Yeah, I guess I'm done here. I have like a hot knife through butter. Oh, Xenoblade Chronicles. Anyways. Oh, fire person. That's right. Can I stop you? Okay, I think I can. Hold up. Wait, I don't know if anything happens if I do. Oh, idea. Idea! 
right here. Does that not do anything? Hold up. This could work. I feel it. I'm spending a lot more time on this than I should. Right here. Haha! -ha. You have a worried look in your eyes. I can, I can tell a problem greatly ails you. Let me tell you something, child. When you know that an arduous and difficult future lies ahead, all you need is hope. Be hopeful of yourself and hopeful of the future. Yes, anything is possible if you believe. And if all else fails, know that at least I will believe in you, alright? Okay. Excellent. Please accept this teaching as a gift. Spicy food. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must be off. Is that it? Spicy food. Interesting. Now, what happens if I say no? Let's see. Anything is possible if you believe, and um, no. Then I must repeat myself. Oh, come on! You got me there. Fine. Enjoy being on fire. So what? What does spicy food do? Let's see. Damages a foe and makes him angry. Ooh, would this deal more damage since we have the equip that like heals more whenever he cooks? Maybe. Huh. That's something to consider. Anyways, I think we've... Oh. I completely forgot that there were enemies out in the overworld. Oh, you're new. This pond water is so clear. It's like I can see a whole other world on the other side. I mean, there is another world on the other side. But, um... Yeah, anyways... Ooh. Are you new? Huh. I kind of want to... to do more of the digging minigame? To see, like, the higher levels of the place? Because I think that's where the X letter is for Hangman. Anyways, um... I think that's gonna be pretty much it for this episode. I might just find the X letter off screen if it is in the digging minigame area. I don't know. But also, we're getting close to filling out Hangman, so I don't know if I want to. But we are missing, uh, let's see, three letters to complete the phrase. Let's see. S, T, and W. Within a live shell in a large bubbly tank and in the gut of a whale. Oh, is the Y letter in the... in the snow cone area? Huh. I don't know. Anyways, with that done... Sure, why not? Uh, with that done, I'm just gonna end it off here. I think we've done pretty much everything there is for us to do in the Orange Oasis. So next time on Amori, we can just continue, I guess, the main story. Thank you all so much for watching, and see you all next time for another episode of Amori. Later. Also, I, I now realize that um, there's like a monument here to the bread twins somewhere. This way, I think. Yeah. Hey. I fought the gods of bread. Interesting, isn't it? But uh, yeah, that, that's gonna be it. So, got got a little bit distracted there. But uh, thank you all so much for watching, and see y'all next time for another episode of Omori. Later. Mm -hmm.